Actually, it, it's different MMA fighters. We can take on the world. It's like you put any MMA fighter against a boxer, he wins. Yeah. It's not, and I started in boxing. Yeah. But all we have to do, it's it's like if I was to fight with Anthony Joshua now, everyone in the world who doesn't know about proper fighting would say Anthony Joshua would win. I'd single leg him and choke him out. Yeah. So he doesn't win. Yeah. Exactly. And that is the truth. What would happen? Stipe versus Engano. I mean, they're two MMA guys, but. Mm -hmm. Finds a way. Single legs and single legs and weighs so him down. That MMA to me, I, I always talk about it. It's so fucking dangerous. And Brazil was an eye opener to me, John, because over there the national sport is like jujitsu. So you could be walking along the street and a guy you think's just a little nerd could be a black belt. Mm. And it happened on many occasions. I'd be like, my mate at Cell used to train with him when he was a kid. He's amazing on the ground. I'd be like, he just looks like some little skinny dude. Yeah. And you could cause a fight and he would strangle you to death. Even a lot of Fighters, I don't think are actual fighters because I see what we do in Carlin and I know a lot of other gyms don't train like we do. Right. I know, like, if you could say now out of England, I know there's other gyms that do, but I know it's a small percentage right. to the people who actually want it. Because, you know, when someone says to me, and I have this conversation with Terry Etam all the time, who's the guy I look up to, when people say they want to be a fighter, Terry will always say, but do you really want to be? Because mm. I've seen what Terry was put through and yeah. what I've been put through with Colin, and I think... You've got to be fucking mad to want to be like a, f a fighter. Yeah. No, you know the Khabibs and and people can say what they want to say about Connor, like he likes to go out and party. But the man puts work in. The man's oh, yeah. a hard worker. Yeah, he is. Yeah. And the Cormiers and the John Joneses and the Ronda Rouseys, like, do you really want to put yourself what they're putting themselves through? Because mm. on tele television, it all looks glamorous. Yeah. In the gym, mate, it's not fucking easy. No. Like. I was terrified to come to the gym this morning because I missed causing me death. Like, I was in the dentist shaking, writing Colin a message. I know we had to be there first, like, Colin, this will never happen again. Like, because, you know what I mean? It's like, I'm terrified of that, man. It's a coach student, a proper coach student relationship. Yeah. As much as you two are pals as well, but he's the guy you go to. He's the guy I go to for everything, and he's the guy I would never even whisper back to, like, a mm. reply. Do you know what I mean? It's like, I'd reply to my nan or anything. If I dared reply to Colin, I know he'd kill me there and then. <laughs> yeah. The only time I ever did it was in Rotterdam, cutting weight, and I was in the bath on my last kilo, and Colin made the bath hotter, and I went, Colin, what are you doing? And he grabbed me and went, don't you fucking speak to me like that. And I went, I'm sorry, <laughs> I'll cut the weight. Oh my God, really? Oops, it's yeah. like that. Listen, like, honestly, there's no man who puts the fear of God into me like Colin. And Colin knows it, like, Colin knows it. Like, yeah, yeah. And I just look up to Colin like, like as a proper master, like when people say, oh, he's me coach, I think, no, he's not. He hasn't got the relationship what I've got with Colin. Do you know what I mean? I don't know who that is. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he shouted at me when Isn't I was a kid. <laughs> uh, but like, Colin puts the fear of God into me. No one in this world does. Yeah. I'm not scared of anyone. Yeah. I'm terrified of Colin. There's always one guy, right? And he says to me, yeah, if we sparred, you'd probably get me now because I'm old. I'm like, I wouldn't because be, I'd be fucking afraid to touch you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mentally, is that scene yeah. there. You wouldn't be able to do what you want to do. Yeah. Should we go to that gym that you were talking yeah. about? No, you haven't ever, you dirty little bastard. Get a top look. Thing that would make him specifically be the way that he is. What, what do you think it is? Because he is different. He is, he's different. His quest for greatness is absolutely bulletproof, isn't it? And it's his single-mindedness. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever it is, yeah. it's inevitable, isn't it?